it's already in high gear right here in the valley. And to elevate our students to do well, Walker Furniture is joining forces with communities and schools to reward the classes that go above and beyond. That's right. The competition is called Elevate Your GPA. And here to explain is the co-owner of Walker Furniture, Linda, Alter Linda Alterwitz Mizrahi, along with Communities and Schools of Southern Nevada Executive Director Shari Ward. It's great having both of you. Thank you. Thanks. Hey, great thank to have having you. us. How uh, are you? So Doing great this morning. Tell me about Good. this partnership. I know that there's a lot of great things that Walker does in the community, and this is just, uh, just another one. Yeah, we love edu education and supporting our Las Vegas community through education. So we're um, partnering with communities and schools, mm -hmm. and they're a national organization that helps students graduate and really achieve in life. And like we always do, we're sponsoring a competition called Elevate Your GPA, right. and the class that uh, elevates their GPA the most during this semester wins. Really? Terrific. Awesome. Yeah, I love this. Yeah. Uh, let's talk about how this contest works. Um, all the students, they just have to really work hard. Mm -hmm. And okay. this is a motivating factor. The, the class that wins, we're going to redo their resource room. Now, the resource room Ooh. is the connecting room that connects the site coordinators and the students. Mm -hmm. gotcha. And uh, we're going to do it up with sofa, love seat, mm. chairs, tables, nice. bookcases, rugs. We're going to make it beautiful and functional for the needs of that school, the winning school. Walker Fantastic. Furniture doesn't yeah. so and, and one more thing, the, nope. yes. another winner is the student in that class whose GPA goes up the most gets a cash prize. I, you know what, as a shit, because they're, they're carrying the whole class on their back. It's the least <laughs> thing you do. Well, and, and I noted you said GPA goes up the most, yes. not with the highest GPA. It's the, something it's different. cumulative. It's the most improved. The, the most improved. Yeah, That's exactly. terrific. Yeah. That's a good way to do it. And, and these yeah. types of competitions, I know how I am. I, I'm a very competitive person. And I know this kind of spurs that, uh, that com <laughs> the competitive energy among the students of Moss. Yes, because what it is is our academy classes. So yeah. there's like 17 of them in eight high schools. Wow. And they're the mm. kids that might not make it to graduation. They need a few more credits um, or a attendance issues and so we pay a teacher prep buyout hour to teach and then our site coordinators are in there to case manage. Fantastic. So it's a it's a great opportunity for them. That's awesome. great. And Sherry, do you already have all the participants lined up or who can participate? Yeah, it is those 17 classes. Yeah. Okay. And then um, what's really neat is last year our classes had a 99% graduation rate. And these no. are kids that, Kidding. yeah, because we do academics, help them get their credits. We do life skills. And then we also do career and college exploration. And these are kids that wow. may have very like, well been a risk. Yeah, they may be missing like five credits, uh, things like that. And so we work to make that happen. Our graduation rates Fantastic. in Clark County are not 99%, as far as I know. So that oh. is a remarkable number, yes. and that's showing yeah. that stuff like this is really working. That's yeah. fantastic. Tell me about the other great stuff that Communities and Schools does. So we put a full-time person, one or two, in a school, and they're there to find out what's keeping the kids from not being successful in school and then mm -hmm. bringing the community resources together to them. And then case manage them and go all along and see how are they doing? You know, mm -hmm. are they improving? It can be from glasses to medical to tutoring. It can be anything like that. But they're there for that one-on-one -on -one relationship to find out what it is. That's fantastic. It's a safety net. Right. Yes. I thought it was really neat that if they need um, food or snacks or backpacks or school supplies, that's the place you go to the resource room and the site mm. coordinators put the students together and get them what they need. Absolutely. Mm. Yeah, really and it's neat. open. Yeah, it's open to the whole school. And it's, it's, that's why it's so important. I think a lot of people, a lot of kids when they're, when they're in school, if they have a, it, circumstances outside of the schoolroom that cause this undue stress and they mm. kill the hope of the kid, that's where the, the, the scores go down. That's mm -hmm. where the care goes out the window. And if you guys can help yeah. patch that up, you can get them back on track, which is brilliant. Yeah, My communities goodness. and schools, they, they give hope. Well, no and you're question. just offering that extra layer of support. That's fantastic. Obviously, the results are amazing, 99%. That's ridiculous. Linda, it's so neat to talk to you because each time you come in, we talk about education. You're so passionate about it. Yeah. How many years have you been working with Clark County Schools? About 18. Yeah. Wow, yeah. fantastic. We've been doing competitions, and I love competitions because, you know, they do a good She's job. She's competitive, too. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> wow. They do a good job. They get rewarded. It's and really yeah. this is not only for uh, communities and schools. It's not only the students who the winning class, but it's the, uh, the site coordinators awesome. and it's mm -hmm. the classes mm -hmm. who come after them. So it's a win-win for right, everybody. They benefit as well. Yeah. The morale, they have a great place boost. to go to, a, a comfortable room and 
Really, yeah. it's right. great work that you're doing. Cool. Fantastic, 99%. Thank you. That's unbelievable. Thank you so much mm -hmm. for joining us. Thank you. Thanks glad for to see us. Walker stepping up once again. They're proud to partner with communities and schools for this innovative competition. You want to find out more about Walker Furniture, their locations right by the Spaghetti Bowl. Walker Furniture, proud sponsor of the Morning Blend. I was just there three days ago. It's a good place to be. I was. Still to come on the morning. You sit on every couch. I did. I, that's, yes. Yeah. <laughs> just yeah. like, oh, this one's a little too soft. Mm. Oh, this one's perfect. <laughs> Still to come on the Morning Blend deals, uh, dealing rather with matters of the heart in a good way. Yes, what the city of Henderson is doing for those who are kind. Ah, you're watching the Morning Blend. <laughs> Stick with us, Sean's. <laughs>Welcome back to the blend Henderson Hyundai Superstore always pushing the envelope on great savings and now they're making it easier than ever for people with busy schedules to discover and test drive a new ride and here with more on that and what we can look forward to this Labor Day weekend is Seth Servin. He is the Gen Genesis Experience Manager at Henderson Hyundai Superstore. Great having you my friend. Nice to be here. All right, so let's talk about this. You're doing something unique for people that are looking to buy a car, but they got a busy life. They don't get time to mess around. What do you it's have? True. So if you are super busy and you don't have time to come down to the dealership, because everyone knows it's daunting. You have to come down. You got to go through all the things. Just give me a call. I'll bring a car. Obviously, you got to know what kind of car you want. I'll bring the car to you. And then you can pretty much take it for a drive. I'll go through the car with you. Make sure you like it. It's no obligation. You don't have to buy it. But if you do like it, we can do everything like that. No kidding. Yeah. That's pretty cool. It's pretty nice. I like that. You can just stay there and be like, yes, bring my car, please. Very good. How, so you've been doing this now for how long? Uh, Genesis has done this for since the beginning. But this is now extending to the Hyundai line. Now Hyundai will do it. Wow. wow. That's pretty yeah. awesome. Uh, you, and you have the, the technology uh, for, for people to go through the entire buying process online. You don't even oh, have yeah. to walk in at all, ever. No, that's true. We just upgraded our like our whole website. So now there's a whole feature you can price your car and then pretty much as long as you have your own financing and everything's already set up for you, we'll pretty much come in, pick up the car or if you just sign on the dotted line and then I'll bring the car to you. Now with all the respect, I mean, you're as a salesperson, mm -hmm. you know, some people, they love dealing with you. Some people, they walk in, they get what they call the agita, yeah. the heartburn. They're yeah. like, oh my goodness. So this is perfect for them. They could still buy the car yeah. without having to feel as though, even though you mean well, mm -hmm. They think, oh no, this guy's out to get me some right. You know, right. that's perfect. So there's great something great for everybody. Of course, yeah, that's a beautiful thing. Uh, let's talk about what's on the lot, uh, Henderson Hyundai Superstore. I know you got a lot of great options. Yeah, yeah. Well, the new thing out right now is the 2018 Sonata. Oh. So change the body style. It oh. looks fantastic. Look at that. Uh, you have to come out and drive this thing. All the tech in this car. You don't have to actually. You could stay yeah. put and drive that you, thing. That's right. Yeah. <laughs> but I mean the. They have vented seats in the Sonata now yes. in like a lower class, so you don't have to get the fully vented loaded seats. Yeah, so cooling down the seats. Because the, 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 the warming seats, that's yeah. almost passe at this point. <laughs> we don't Cooling need seats, that's like next level seat yeah. technology. Yeah, that's, it's, it's something that you, in Vegas, you kind of need to have it. I wish I had it, yeah. But uh, I mean, all the tech in this car, it's amazing. We, I was actually noticing in, this, in that picture, I saw the Apple CarPlay. Yep. I'm assuming Android Auto, part of that of package course, as well. Of course, So whatever you have, really, once you have it and you plug it in, my goodness, you'll never want a car without that again. Oh, no, definitely. It's remarkable. I know this is a big time of year for, for you and the car industry in general. You get a Labor Day coming up. Mm -hmm. This is usually a great weekend for, for, for deals. What do you have for deals? Well. Labor Day, well, so let's just start before Labor Day, oh. from now until then. Oh, so you have now, you can do yeah, it today. you All can right. come in and get deals now. So right now you can come in and get no payments till March of next year. Okay. So seven months, no payments. That's good. Um, there is, we're also doing on September 4th, you can come in and we're doing a huge lot party. Like there's going to be music, there's going to be giveaways, um, and also the grand prize giveaway because uh, Porta Subs, we teamed up with them. Okay. And they're celebrating 45 years of slicing fresh. Yes. So they're they have uh, they're giving away a Veloster essentially. So you can come down now and put your name in for it. It's a little box inside of our dealership that you can. And I, I'll tell you what, not a lot of people have done it. So it's your, your chances the are pretty odds good. Odds are pretty good, and especially yeah. in Vegas to get good odds, tough. Yeah. So enter and like, listen. It's a great thing. I, the Veloster, for those who don't know, by the way, is a Fast little bugger. Oh yeah, yeah. It's stylish. It looks good, and they've been putting this car around the lot, or around the valley, so you can take a look at it. Yeah. And I haven't seen a lot of people like come in and like, oh, you know, I saw the car. I've seen a couple, and I'm like, man, they have good chances. So the odds are pretty good that you can yeah. win a Veloster, and it really is a mean looking car. I like yeah. it. It's really nice lines. Um, the in the Genesis line as well. When people are thinking uh, upper echelon of cars. Mm -hmm. 
uh, Genesis is really starting to shake things up as far as the, the, the high end. It, it really is. I mean, you're going in, you're looking at cars that are $130,000 plus, yeah. and then you're comparing them to something that's sixty, seventy thousand. dollars You're like, oh, like, and it has all and the It has all the features. features. Yep, exactly. I mean, and you get a better warranty. Like, that's a 10-year, 100,000-mile warranty with that car. See, that's the one beautiful thing with Hyundai is you guys, not only you sell the car or Genesis, you sell the car, but you stand by the car for the next decade. Yeah. I which mean, is it's remarkable. It's impressive. Those cars are, by its hands, hands down, drive that car compared to another one. I've had people do it all the time. They'll drive an S550 or something crazy, mm -hmm. and they'll come in and buy this one. Wow. It really is turning heads. You're going to check it out, my friend. Pleasure. Thank you so much. Thanks so much. I'm just going to start calling them every day. Yeah, bring me over that Sonata. Yeah, I'll try the Veloster today. Might just try well. different flavors. Uh, discover that all new Sonata or another ride, whichever one you, uh, you prefer, at Henderson Hyundai Superstore. They're located on Boulder Highway in Henderson, and their website and number are right there on your screen. They're a proud sponsor of the Morning Blend. And make sure you enter to win that Veloster. That would be pretty awesome. And you could drive me around. Be my <laughs> personal Uber. Up next on the Morning Blend, a special award in Henderson that cuts to the heart of the matter. And hey, are you on Facebook or Twitter? Well, you should like or follow us. We're Las Vegas Morning Blend on Facebook, LV Morning Blend on Twitter. Links can be found on our site. We'll be back. Welcome back to the Blend. Kindness is in the heart of our valley, and now you can recognize someone for what they've done for others. The city of Henderson is looking to recognize those who make a difference in other people's lives with their Heart of the City Award. Here with more is Kim Becker with the city of Henderson. Good morning, Kim. Hi, Good Kim. morning. Thanks so much for having me great on. I appreciate it. I'm so excited to talk about this. It's so great to be recognizing people for doing kind things, for doing good things, and just to, to have an award that's positive. Yeah, I have happy. anything positive on yeah. TV right now is good. Absolutely, it's nice so thank good you. news. No question. <laughs> so let's talk about the Heart of the City Award. So the Heart of the City Award recognizes somebody in the community who has done exceptional acts of kindness or a very distinctive service that benefits mm -hmm. other people here in the community. Mm -hmm. Terrific. You're in your third year. It's our third year doing the, the award. award, yes. Uh, and past recipients, have received the award for doing what kind of great things? Well, last year's recipient's name was J.T. Reynolds, and he's actually a 40-year retired Park Service worker, and he's used that experience to benefit children here in the community. He has an outdoor education program out at Sloan Canyon, oh, wow. and he teaches children about the importance of conservation and respecting the environment. Mm. So it's a fantastic. And the first recipient was actually Drew Stevens, the father of Josh Stevens, oh, founder of the Josh, of the Josh Stevens Foundation. Such a nice so guy. a he fantastic man. Such a great job with that organization. Now there's a yes. school named after his Absolutely. son. Absolutely. And his father is just a phenomenal guy. Uh, so this is really a call out, not, not hey, hey, everyone do good things now. There's a lot of people out there doing great things. Mm. It's uh, up to the people who might be good people to recognize those great people. Absolutely, and that's exactly the purpose of the award. It's for people in the community to recognize others who have given back. Mm -hmm. It might be a coach, a volunteer coach, uh, a, a volunteer at a nursing home, mm -hmm. a student, a teacher, a business person. Could be anybody in the community that's given back or had distinctive service to others. In the city of Henderson, of course. The, in the city of Henderson, yes. yes. Gotcha. Terrific, and let's, let's talk about the, the committee who gives the award out? Who, who's the committee made out of? What are their criteria? So the committee is comprised of city employees who serve on the Be Kind Committee. And the Be Kind Committee is exactly that, a group of people that work for the city mm -hmm. that are trying to get the message out for people to be kind. Not just at the city, but throughout the community. Whether it's at our parks, or when people go to the mall, or your grocery shopping. If on everybody did one, <laughs> on the road, yes. if, everybody, oh. if everybody did one, one act of kindness a day, just one, what a fantastic community we would have. Ah. No question, it's the truth. So that's what it's about. It, it's so simple, but it's so profound. It's, <laughs> it, it, it's the truth. And, and, and it's worth noting, by the way, that kindness does not have an age. I mean, you, you know, you, you could have a kind 10-year-old and you can have a kind 100-year-old. Mm -hmm. I'm sure you've given out to a myriad of different ages. We have, and actually we have a, 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 an award that goes with this one, and it's called the Kindness is Key Award. And that's for children that participate in the city's Safe Key and Teen Scene program. Cool. And so we give that out quarterly, where we would have the mayor meet with the children and give a certificate, have photos taken. And usually it's for a child in Safe Key that's helped another child with a kind act that might typically go unnoticed. For example, 
a new child that's kind of sitting off by themselves yeah. where a student might go and say, hey, come play with us or let me help you with your homework. Just, it's amazing what kids can do to be kind too. Absolutely. So, but, but kids can be nominated for the Heart of the City Award too. Great. Fantastic. How do people become nominated and how long do we have to nominate somebody? So anybody can make a nomination and you would just go to our website at cityofhenderson.com backslash be kind. Okay. And we have through October 1st to make a nomination. The form is very simple. Mm. Information about the person you're nominating, information about yourself, and then what kind of kindness you're nominating the person for, for Absolutely. consideration. We were looking at this a picture, by the way, of the mayor uh, posing with a few of the kids there with certificates, which is just like, I remember when I first met the mayor, I never got a certificate, by the way, I was not nearly as cool as some of these kids are, but uh, it, it's, it's a really, it's a great moment for them to realize that good does not go unnoticed. It's true, and they bring yeah. their parents to meet with the mayor, and Fantastic. they bring their siblings, and for Heart of the City, this year, the award will be giving, uh, given out at the November 7th City Council meeting, so we'll have Mayor March, the members of the city council, and the recipient will receive its an etched crystal heart. Love that. And they'll know in advance mm. so they can invite family and friends to attend the council meeting as well. Doing excellent work. Kudos to the city of Henderson. Absolutely. Thank yeah. you so Thank much. So much. Appreciate That's great. It. All right. You can nominate someone for the Heart of the City Award for Henderson. Nominations are going to be accepted through October 1st. You can download a form online. Just head to cityofhenderson.com slash be kind. Number is also listed there. They're on Facebook and Twitter as well. I love that. Yeah. Speaking of Henderson, before we had a break, we have a community event to share with you. Oh, we do. The district at Green Valley Ranch will kick off their fall free concert series. It kicks off on September 9th. It's held Saturday evening through October 14th. First up, Skylar Elaine will perform in the courtyard off the main, uh, the main street at the district. I love walking that street. It's just so much fun, it's very nice. isn't it? We're coming right back. Welcome back to The Blend. Sam's Care's mission is to help make our community a better place to live. And they do so by having an education council, which is like a partnership of like-minded organizations committed to a high-quality educational system here in Southern Nevada. That's right. Teach for America is one of those partners. Their mission is to improve outcomes for kids throughout the country, including right here in the Valley. And since 2004, Teach for America has worked with the Clark County School District, charter schools, and others to tackle educational inequity. And here to explain more is Sean Parker and Carla Chambers of Teach for America of the Las Vegas Valley. Great having both of you. Hello. It's great to be here. Thank Very excited to be here. Good so to I, I hope I did it justice explaining, but if, if I mm. didn't, please explain what Teach for America is. Absolutely, absolutely. I think y'all, yeah, you like did a Sean good good it. intro. Good. Um, <laughs> I joined Teach for America back in 2009 out of college at a degree in neuroscience and was gonna pursue a path in research. Mm -hmm. But when I was thinking about what I wanted to do for the rest of my life, I thought about the inequities that a lot of our kids face in the schools mm -hmm. around mm -hmm. the surrounding communities where I was going to college, similar to some of the inequities our kids face right here in Las Vegas their educational opportunities are just not the same as other students. And we live in a country where factors, including you can predict sometimes where a kid is born, the zip code that they're born into, some of the outcomes that they'll have yep. in the future, no which is just not morally right for me. I want every kid mm -hmm. to have access to an equitable and excellent education. And so Teach for America works to enlist and find amazing leaders to work in schools for at least two years and go on to be leaders who change the system because the system's not working for all kids yet. Wow, this is great. Well, let's talk about what you've accomplished so far in your mission. Yeah, so as you noted, we've been here since 2004 and we've brought in um, some amazing leaders amazing to our leaders. community yeah. um, who are doing great things, who are sitting in the State Department of Education here, who are still teaching in our community, who have been wow. for 12 years now. Um, and tr trying to change outcomes for kids right here in Las Vegas. Absolutely. Mm. Uh, the, the, the zip code thing, I mean, this is something that I've been saying for a while, and I know right. some people might not realize, but we so often hear, I'm the first person in my family to graduate Absolutely. high school. Absolutely. I'm the first person in my family to go to college. And often, this the, the inequity, it, it it's the family you're born into. It's Absolutely. the community you're born into, and it's, you're just a victim of circumstance. Right. And you're helping to try to break that cycle. We do, we do. Um, we bring in over 100 teachers, and especially this year has been the most exciting year. Um, our teachers come from everywhere. Mm. They are the most diverse and talented individuals, and I'm actually very passionate about it because I actually joined Teach for America after being a school leader here in the city. Fantastic. So I hired them, and I was like, oh. I believe in it wholeheartedly because these mm. were the teachers who actually helped shape the community that I was being a part of 
that was really going to break some of the systemic challenges that are yeah. happening um, in our city. Um, and our professional development is is really strong, is research-based, it's about leadership, mm -hmm. it's about finding the assets of what's happening in our communities because there's some beautiful, amazing, talented students and families in our communities. We just need the resources and we need mm -hmm. to make sure our teachers are equipped with the knowledge, the skills, how to be culturally responsive yeah. and be able to actually drive high bar of excellence and standards so our kids can have access. They have mm. it, we're gonna provide it, and our teachers are ready to do this work. And it's so exciting knowing that we're here in the Valley making it happen. Fantastic. We've got some great leaders Terrific. here in this city. No question. <laughs> That's great, and some great <laughs> partnerships as well here in the city. Amazing partnerships. So you work with Las Vegas Sands. We do. Yeah, That's we right. do. Las Vegas yeah. Sands, uh, we couldn't do this work without partners. So um, earlier on the show, you actually had Communities and Schools, That's which right, has yeah. been a community mm -hmm. partner of ours for several years. Fantastic. But we work with Las Vegas Sands, has been partnering with us for several years, and we couldn't do the work yep. without the investment that they make in us, but also bringing mm. talented individuals together to solve problems in coalition. You talked about the council that they put together. Mm -hmm. It's amazing to sit across the table from somebody from Communities and Schools and discuss what can we do together um, to utilize the talents yep. of our community. Yeah. The, the, these, yeah. these kids that go through school, I like, like to call them rockets. They're rockets. They, are. they have to have a <laughs> solid launching pad. There we you go. You provide that, there they can go. fly. Yes. Seeing that you've been here since 2004, yeah. let's talk about some of the alumni in this program. Oh, amazing alumni. Let's talk about one in particular who actually works as an academy director with the community and school program that was just on here. Fantastic. That was like, oh, wow. I was like, yes, right Hedgen is go. like, just joined the team, amazing leader here, um, worked at Valley High School um, as, a, as a teacher. So she's been an amazing leader. We have other amazing leaders who are actually have opened up schools, they're school directors here, some are principals, even an assistant principal at the new Marzano School. No which is amazing. Um, what a, one alumni in particular, you know I have to shed a little light, illuminate this, this little blossom of love. Um, we have a teacher who's at Sunrise Mountain High School who has totally changed the trajectory of students in science and STEMs. Um, mm, which is something that we severely right? lack in as exactly. a country. Yes. Exactly, exactly. Um, his program has actually brought in a huge robotics and they've been working with drones, they've been working with UNLV, and it's amazing the trajectory of the students that are in it. I've seen young mm. ladies who have actually like started to talk about being engineers. This is an amazing program. And all awesome. of this came because mm. in his previous year before he joined Teach for America, he was a huge science person and that was his degree. And he was like, how do I bring this into the school? And the school said, this is our need. He filled it and Perfect. shot through it. Yeah. And it's amazing, yeah. right? Fantastic work that you guys <laughs> are doing. And we have so many more other leaders just like that. You guys, thank you so much. It's so uplifting. All the, all the talent and potential is there, and you're, you're helping make it happen. That's great. Thank you. Help Thank solve you. educational inequity right here in our valley. To learn more about the mission of Teach for America, visit the website or call the number that's right there on your screen. And, hey, Sean, they're on Facebook. Uh, so I hear. Yeah. All the kids are nowadays. <laughs> Teach for America is one of the, pro the partners in the SANS Education Council, which is part of the SANS Cares program. And for more information about them, you can find mm. it at SANS.com. SANS Cares, proud sponsor of the Morning Blend. Mm -hmm. Stay right here on Channel 13 After Us. It's The View. Oh, it is. And today, author Neil deGrasse Tyson talks about his book, Astrophysics for People in a Hurry, which is good because we're all in yeah. a hurry. Yeah. But we're in a hurry to get to a break. We're coming right back. <laughs> So you gotta pay attention because a wider smile can make you more attractive and take years off your appearance, but it won't take years to do. All it takes is five minutes. Here to explain is lifestyle expert Scott DeFalco is here to share an easy way to make us look more confident. Sean, the great Swabby is here to remove all of Las Vegas's teeth staining demons. Thank you for having <laughs> this me. This is very uh, Johnny Carson of you, the great Swabby. Foul teeth staining demons be out. Let's yeah. talk about this. Power swabs where it's at. Yes. What's so cool about this product? There are a lot of things that are cool about it. And it's really taken the world by storm, Sean. You know, I've been coming here for over a year now and I've been doing this for over three years. And the reason is because of the differences between power swabs and the other products out there that people have tried, the strips and the trays. Number yeah. one, you're gonna get results in less than five minutes. 
rates. I'm going to do a quick demo here in just a second to show everyone at home how simple it is. Mm -hmm. Number two, I feel the biggest advantage is that there's minimal to no sensitivity with it. Excellent. Yes. And number three is that it restores your caps, crowns, and veneers to their original color, a major issue people out there have who have had a cosmetic dental procedure because over time their smile goes uneven. Exactly. And this yeah. is the one thing because I have that and I, I thought right. that the, the, the strips, those messy strips and stuff weren't mm -hmm. able to do that. This can do that. They and cannot do, it well. do that. Yes. And this was developed by a dentist mm -hmm. and that's why he, he realized that was a big problem. So he took years developing this. He's an award winning dentist, Dr. Martin Ginniger. Mm -hmm. And uh, it's been one of the biggest draws of this product because when you get it done, it looks great. But over time, like I said, the smile will go uneven. And unless yeah. you want to invest another seven to $10,000, which nobody wants to do, no. you can use this product. And that's one of the reasons why it's been so popular. I like it. Fantastic. <laughs> let's, uh, let's take a look at a picture here. Mm -hmm. um, this is kind of an important test that you want to share with viewers. Yeah, it's called the Would You Rather, sort of a variation of a game my buddies and I would play in college, Sean, oh, but we will not get into that. <laughs> so <laughs> we paddled 100 women and we said, who would you rather spend time with or kiss? You know, the guy on the left with the Freddy Krueger teeth or Ooh. the guy on the right with the bright white smile? Of and of course you'd go to the right. Yes. Heck, I might kiss the guy. <laughs> yeah, the right. Well, if you had a choice, yeah. Uh, yes, and she's so, a very beautiful uh, girl. The only difference is the teeth. Right, and what we did, 100% of the women had said the guy on the right, but yeah. we also paneled 100 men, Sean, and mm -hmm. you being a man, we know that we're not as picky or choosy with who we will spend <laughs> no, time with no. or necessarily kiss, but 100% yes. of the men picked the girl on the right. So the lesson learned here is that you can look great on the outside and then all the you know bells and whistles, but if your teeth are yellow or stained, it really destroys your appearance. And frankly, that, that, that it makes you it makes you look older. It yes. makes you look unhealthy. Completely. So yeah. let's uh, not that you look like it, not like you need it, but I want you to demo the power swabs for us. Yeah, this is great. Show how it works. And people love seeing this because it's a quick two-step process and a patented technology. And the first step is the stain out swab. Okay. So you rub it on your top and bottom teeth just like this, Sean. Okay. And I'm gonna do this for two minutes. Obviously, we have TV time constraints. Yes. Over that two minutes, we accomplish two things. Number one, we actually lift the stain off of our teeth. We talked about the strips and the trays. Mm -hmm. They'll whiten the stain, but they don't remove it. And at the same time, we hydrate our enamel, and that's why you don't get the sensitivity. It's gotcha. that formula in the stain out swap. Because other stuff may actually chip away at the enamel. Exactly. Yeah. It'll eat away at it. I do a laundry analogy. I mm -hmm. think I did that's the last time I was here yes, because you told me that you do or you do not do your own laundry. I do my own laundry you do. every five weeks. Okay. <laughs> Well, he must as to be that little specific. As possible. Um, so if you did your whites, uh, you would put your detergent in first to yeah. get the stain out, get them smelling fresh and clean. Then you would put your bleach in to whiten them. Well, like, using the other products is like not putting your detergent in. It's like just putting bleach on your whites. Think about what yeah. that would do to your clothes. Of course. If you did that, that's the same thing those products do to your teeth, and that's why you get so much pain with them. So this is like our pseudo detergent. Got it. The stain out um, swab, and now we're going to whiten. Okay. This same is process. the bleach portion. This yes. is it. Although it's not actual bleach. Right. Do not put bleach in your mouth at home. It is a. Uh, <laughs> it is a carbamide peroxide, okay. it's called, Sean, which is a much less harsh solution, and that's another reason why you don't get the sensitivity. So you do that for less than five minutes, for about two to two and a half, and what I just did, on average, you're going to get two shades whiter after the first use, six shades over seven days, results are going to last up to six months, it's amazing. There's a lot of people that have been told they have to cut out the coffee because, right. you know, your, your teeth are just, yeah, it's, it's not magnificent right. anymore. Now they can have their coffee and keep the white smile. They can do whatever they want because yeah. Power Swabs is going to counteract that. You get that a lot, and one of the grossest things you'll, ew. Ew, ew. It's on your screen right now. That is disgusting, Sean. And that's showing and up that's on your, yeah. And that's what you're doing to your teeth. On those pearly you whites. Stay, imagine you're on a you know nice date and you go to kiss someone and they smile and you see that. Ugh. Game over. And this is the girl right here that we actually paneled 100 people. We digitally altered it, but they guessed that the girl on the right was up to 13 years younger. That's fantastic. Yeah, really, really quickly, is. there's a quick stick. Yes. Tell me about your quick stick. <laughs> I certainly will, Sean, and thank yes. you for asking. Right. Uh, this is the On The Go Stain Out Quick Stick. We're going to give you these for free today if you take advantage of our Morning Blend Special, which we'll talk about. And I call this Tide For Your Teeth, speaking of the laundry analogy. Uh, and this is great because after you do the uh, seven days, less than five minutes a day, you're going to need um, something for the daily maintenance. You're of drinking course. your coffee, eating. This is what you do. You simply take it out of your pocket or your purse, pop the top, spin Simple. it, gel will come up. You rub it on your teeth like I do with the swab, Sean. It's like brushing your teeth because it will lift the stains off of them before they set in. Keep your smile bright white. We have a few seconds left. I just yep. want to make sure that we take a look at this shade chart. So see okay. where you can, where you started to where you can finish when you have yep. uh, power swabs. It really is incredible. It is, and I call it a shade a day. And uh, Sean, I can't stress enough that you really, you can be in perfect physical condition, but if your teeth are yellow or stained, it really, really, um, adversely affects your appearance. And there's the shade chart after one use on top, after seven days on the bottom. Really it's really, cool. really incredible. Scott's great having you. Thanks, buddy. buddy. Thank you so All much. Right.
power swaps completely risk free. Try it right now. Everyone who calls is going to get free shipping and a free quick stick with their order. You're welcome very much. <laughs> also, be sure to ask about their buy two, get one free promotion. You can give one to a friend or save them both for yourself. But you need to call now because supplies are limited. For more information on power swaps and how it works in just minutes, head to the website or call the number you see right there on your screen. Power Swaps, proud sponsor of the Morning Blend. Well, Sean and Scott, thank you so much. Tired of struggling with unwanted pounds? You are not alone. Well, there's a brand new wellness and weight loss center opening in town that utilizes state-of-the-art equipment to help you burn fat and sculpt that body. Here to help is Jared Norman and Sean Larkin. Both gentlemen are chiropractors, and they are the owners of Frost Fit. Welcome to the show. Thank you. Thank you. We're glad to be here. On the eve of your grand opening. It yeah, is. that's really exciting. Yeah. Great, tell us all about FrostFit. What's the concept? So the concept of FrostFit is that we have a recovery, weight loss, and, and uh, a center just to be able to burn out the extra calories, shed the extra pounds, recover faster from injuries and working out, and just helping the body to feel better and get better. Excellent. I think it's so interesting. You're both chiropractors. Yes. Yeah. You came together. You, you want to create this center. Uh, who's this going to benefit? Who is this, who's CrossFit geared towards? Every, everyone. Anyone and everyone who wants to feel better, have a happier life, that live with chronic pain, that are tired of living with chronic pain, this is something that could benefit them. Not saying that it will go away, but it will benefit them and help them to get out there and do more things that they want to do. Awesome. Okay, so you're really targeting two things at CrossFit. Right. Mm -hmm. You're targeting this uh, reduction of pain, pain management, and also shedding some pounds. That's right, some shedding pounds. the pounds. But it's the way that you do that that is so it's kind unique. of state of the art. Absolutely, yes. Uh, let's start off by talking about something you're going to have uh, in, your, in your location, and it's called a cryo chamber. Did I say it right? The cry cryo, cryo chamber. Cryo yeah. chamber. Yeah. Cryo, cryo chamber. chamber. What is a cryo chamber? So a cryo chamber is, the one that we have is totally different uh, than in the valley. It's the first one in the valley that's a chamber where you walk into it and 